Hey everyone, it's Awana Turtle and happy Team Up release day. Um, I do have some booster boxes on route. Uh, however, since it was released, I did go to my local GameStop. I did pick up Elite Trainer Box. <clears throat> Had to pay the, the full retail price, which was uh, considerably more expensive than the rates that you can get packs for um, booster boxes. But definitely excited about this. Oh, I really like, actually, the box though. I really like, um, I really like that blue. I feel like the Zekrom and Pikachu art is really nice. So I'm very happy that, or, you know, I have no regrets about getting this. Even the sleeves. As far as the uh, Elite Trainer Box sleeves, I think this might be my favorite by far. So we got all the regular stuff. You do have their new, a bunch of their new energies. And we got GX counter, the team up packs. Let's see, the team up cards. Actually, I think I kind of like all of them. I feel like the coolest one is the Gengar. I feel like it looked just very menacing. Zekrom Pikachu, I really like, want the full art because I really like this, uh, the color scheme. Venusaur Celebi, I feel like Venusaur gets a, <laughs> has a bad rap for uh, as far as starters go. Celebi is pretty cool. Uh, Eevee Snorlax, I like both of those guys. And, oh, I don't, there's no, um, and also the Wailord Magikarp, even that one, the, uh, that one is just the, the interesting combo, like Magikarp paired up with anything. Uh, doesn't seem like the, the most useful partner in crime, so I find that hilarious. So, let's jump into this. The cardstock feels very, very smooth. Like, it feels like there's very little texture. Uh, I'm not sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing, to be honest. We got a Jinx, Nidoran, Larvitar, which looks like he looks like a sweater as far as that background. Vulpix, our looks familiar. Pawnard, Pawn, Pawnard Yard. Fairy Charm, Reverse, and a Bronzong. Yeah, you know what? The cardstock feels very strange to me. Feels very smooth. Maybe thin, too. Like, even just opening the packs, feels like the, the packs are flimsier. Uh, let me know if you guys notice the same thing. If I didn't buy this from a GameStop, a part of me would almost, like, be concerned if the cards are fake. Oh, uh, we got Metal Goggles, a Gold Duck, Charmander, I do like that art, find it very cute. Hone Edge, one of the, one of the weirder Pokemon. Cosmog, Electrode, and a Ferrothorn. Okay. So far, no hits. Elite Trainer Boxes are very hit or miss. The, don't get that many packs. The pull rates are, or there, I would say there are no like common, there, you shouldn't really have any expectations. Uh, could be anything. And it feels, it hurts really bad when, when you end up with nothing to show for your booster, for your trainer box. Imoga, pretty cool art. We have a Magikarp. Execute, Helioptile, Meowth, Heliovisk, Reverse, and, ooh, all right, our first tag team card. We got Latios and Latias. Forgot about them. Um, feel like it's interesting card uh, discard three energy uh, feels too expensive but the Latios and Latias was always a a confusing the those two guys they're like they're like they look like rockets but I do like the um, the I think like the rainbow rare and probably the full art I do like, they kind of almost make like a heart shape or something. All right, we got Nidorina. It's psychic type, which I found kind of interesting. Execute. Uh, buff padding, interesting card. Uh, I'm not sure 
of what things have retreat costs of four, but it's a pretty big buff. Got the Nidoran, Mareep, Alolan Executor, and a Ninetales. <clears throat> I feel like Sun and Moon sets, there's like always a Ninetales. Between the, I don't know, most of them are Alolan. Wow, what, what's going on here? This pack does not want to open at all. There we go. Alright, so we do have one GX and it is a tag team, which is pretty nice. Alright, next pack. Evelyn, these new supporters, they are sound okay. And then the one where you have to discard the other two is I find very strange. Sabrina's suggestion, pretty cool. I feel like that's a full art that I'm um, interested in getting. Actually, the the original trainers are the um, I don't know all the region names, but essentially the uh, the OG trainers. I really like the idea of them bringing them back. So we do have a Zorark. Ah, short Zorark and Greninja. Another. Yeah, actually every every team up set uh, pairing. I uh, I guess I want them all. I find that's really cool too. Oh, all right, we got a green, a green pack. Go through this one kind of fast. But yeah, we only have two packs left. This one's not gonna have anything. So yeah, Elite Trainer Boxes, they're, uh, they're risky. Unless you get it on sale, don't really feel like it's worth it. Ooh, that Blastoise art though, pretty cool. And even the packs feel a little weird. I wonder if the like the this was printed from a different, very different um, like factory or whatever compared to the last couple sets. I feel like the difference is very noticeable. Okay, we got Undentified Fossil. HP just keeps going up. Farfetched, Tentacruel. Always thought Tentacruel and Tentacruel always pretty cool. Pidgeotto, Nidoran, Cosmog, Magikarp. Blitzel looks very happy and a Alolan Muck. Alolan Muck. Not sure how why he's rainbow colored, but all right, last pack. So we did get one hit, but feels oh, I don't know why I keep turning that over, but we do have a chance. Let's see if we can't do this. All right, we got Darkness Energy, Dual Blade, Tentacruel, Return Label. Put a card from your opponent's discard pile on the bottom of their deck. Hmm, why? Geodude, Bronzor, Dratini, Tentacruel, Ponyta, Water Memory. Oh, we still have these memory cards. And last, ooh, Mr. Mime. We got the magic odds. And then for each card your opponent has, put one damage counter on their active Pokemon. Magic odds, kind of interesting, interesting mechanic. All right, so we did get one Rare Hollow in Zorark. And then for the GXs, we did get a Mr. Mime in Latias and Latios. So not the, not a great opening, but um, definitely very excited for the boxes that I did order for them to arrive, they should be here um, in the next couple business days. So really excited about that. Um, and we'll go from there. On that, thanks for watching guys. Uh, if, if you can, drop a like on the video if you did enjoy the content. Uh, please hit subscribe for future content. We're going to be doing a good number of team up openings in the near future. On that, thanks for watching again and I'll see you guys next time. Later.